All right, we back. We got to update. We got the high here. It's been a while since I held her. I, I haven't really held her since she started eating a lot of mice because she wasn't really eat the frozen mice. I don't know if she's going to bite me. She jumped at me a couple times, but she's gotten big. I don't know if, like, you probably haven't seen her. In the picture, the last picture, she was probably pretty big. She's loosening up as soon as I put the, and she's looking at me like she's about to bite me. But, they say her bite will be like sandpaper. She's getting this look in her eye like she's about to. But she is loosening up. But like I said, she hasn't, I haven't picked her up in a minute. So, I'm trying to get her back used to my touch. It's kind of squeezing my thumb. I'm not really worried about squeezing. She's loosening up though. I don't know. She just be sitting in the hide. She don't really do too much. I don't know what, what she'll do if she sees herself. Like, I know you're supposed to pick her up. I used to pick her up all the time, but shit, that was like a year ago. She was real small. She's a little bigger. I don't want to get her too close to my face. But if she, like, strikes at me, I'm good. But she ain't been eating lately. Like she eat, she ate like two weeks ago. She ain't, the last the I got a rat that sat in the tank and died. And then she ate the next mouse I got her. It was a large mouse that didn't look too big. And then I got her a mouse last week and I starved to death too. So she don't be eating like that. She was like eating, like as soon as they got in the tent. Sometimes they would sit there, but I don't know. The last couple of times they go in there high and she just let them run around in there. Like I said, I'm trying to get her used to getting touched again, but she seems to be all right. I know there was a period of time she was getting a little, like I would go near the uh, old tank up there terrarium whatever you want to call it and she would jump at the screen but she did that like twice but she seemed to calm down i gave her like a i gave her after she calmed down after i gave her uh the rat for the first time but she seemed to be chilling there like she's pretty long i say she's over a foot long she's like i don't know like I said, this is the first time I picked her up in a while, so and you want to get her used to the touch. She eats a lot of mics, so but she eats enough where I guess she's still not too aggressive. But uh, it is what it is. It is what it is. Uh, she's just sitting there now. She don't like really. Like I said, in the um, terrarium, she sits there. She comes more out, she comes out more at night. They told me she, like, the ball pythons will come out more than some other snakes. But she just be chilling. She'll come out and roam around for, like, 15 minutes. Then she'll go back in the hide and just wrap up and chill. Like, I don't know. It's kind of cold. It's not cold, like, not for me. But, like, I know the summer was um, warm. And uh, office is in the attic, so I don't know. It usually stays warm all summer. It'd be like hot in here. But uh, the winter, but she got a, um, I got two heaters over there for her. The joint that came with the first terrarium. I don't know. She's not really moving too much. And like I said, I don't want her to bite me, so. I mean, since she don't eat, I guess I'm going to try to start feeding her, like, maybe every couple of weeks. But, again, like, I don't want her to get aggressive. But since I guess she don't be hungry because uh, she don't be hungry because she don't be eating. They be running all around her and she just be letting them. So, I guess she be cool because if she ain't going to snap at a mouse, then she ain't going to snap at me. But like I said, she'll eat when she get hungry. Cause I know that when I, that week, that off week that she ate, 
As soon as it went in the hide, she jumped at it. The rat, I guess she was, she, I don't know if the rat was on her. The one that starved to death, the first one that starved to death. I don't know if it was on her or what. But I know she like jumped at it, but it ran away. But she didn't make no effort to go out and get it. She'd be crawling around, slithering around, whatever you want to say. And she'll just let the mouse just live and run around while she's slithering around. The one time, like, she was basically on top of the mouse and left it alone. But I'm about to put her back now.